Hey everyone, thanks for coming back. I just wanted to share with you guys today some of my Scentsy favorites. So however you're watching this, uh, whether it's on my YouTube channel or on Facebook, welcome. Um, so first of all, I want to share with you um, what my favorite product is. So my favorite product that Scentsy offers, um, obviously besides Hi, Angel. Um, besides the warmer and wax is the Scentsy Laundry Stuff. The Scentsy Laundry Stuff, I'm so technical. Um, hi, Alicia. So Scentsy Laundry for me has been one of my favorite products since I brought it out. Hi, Justine. Hi, Erica. It's, um, I don't know, I just find that Besides the fact that it smells absolutely amazing, I was concerned about how well it washed and how long the scent lasted. And then when I tried it, I was pretty impressed. I'm looking for the page so I can give pricing. Um, I should have been a little bit more prepared. Hi, Maria in Spain. How exciting is that? Hi, Candace. Thank you. Hi, Maritza. <gasps> Hi. And Rebecca, hi everybody. So, okay, so the laundry stuff is my favorite product that Scentsy sells, um, besides obviously the warmer and wax. But I've tried a bunch of different scents and I have come down to a couple that are my favorite. And honestly, I would not have come to these conclusions if I had not tried them. So first and foremost, the laundry liquid works really, really well. Um, and I have to say that depending on how much you use, um, you're going to find that you don't need a lot. Sorry, I almost dropped it. That <laughs> um, you don't need a lot. It's highly concentrated. So this is 20 fluid ounces um, and it's got the pump. And you know what? To be honest, in a regular load, I probably put about three pumps um, in a load of really dirty clothes. Um, I probably put five. I don't know that I've really put any more than that. Um, and don't use, you're going to get scent from this, but don't use this for the scent. So in other words, people will put like 10 pumps because they want it to smell more. Don't do that. You're wasting it. You don't need a lot of soap to get your clothes clean. Um, oh, good, Becky. And so what I tell people is if you want this for the soap, then fine, do that. But the thing that you really want, if you want smelling good smelling clothes, is the washer whiffs. The washer whiffs are amazing. So if you wanted to use your own laundry, and I'm not saying this so that you don't buy our laundry liquid because it works really, really well. Um, but like if some people have to have Tide, I know that some people are very sensitive to laundry detergent. Um, I've not had anybody complain that is sensitive to laundry detergent that's used this, they've not had problems. So just FYI. Um, hi, Bailey. So what was I saying? Miss Squirrel. <laughs> um, so yeah, if you need to use like an unscented Tide, then do that, but get these. So these are, all this is, FYI, um, it's very non-toxic and I wanna see if it shows the ingredients. It's got a fragrance carrier um, with the fragrance. I learned one, at one point that this was salt, and I'm not 100% sure if that's correct or not. Um, I'm gonna have to find out, but someone, somewhere, I heard that it was. Anyway, so this tub is 30 ounces, 48 ounces, and oh, it smells amazing. My husband swears by Scentsy Laundry because he has natural oily skin and his uniforms always stink. Scentsy Laundry to the rescue and the musty smell is gone. Yeah, see? This is the magic stuff right here, I think. This is like, it's totally magic. Um, I usually use about one scoop or two, depending <laughs> how big the load is. Um, and my favorite scent, as of right now, is Honeymoon Hideaway. I've used white tea, cact white tea and cactus in the past. I don't find it strong enough. 
I loved black, I loved perfectly pomegranate, but they don't have that anymore. Black raspberry vanilla. I would never have guessed I would have loved it, but I do. Um, smells amazing. And then I use French lavender for my sheets and blankets and pillows and towels. On top of that is the dryer discs. Um, I use these a lot of different places besides dryers. You get two in a package and uh, they just smell amazing. If you, caught, if you guys could see my dryer, you would see that there's like 300 of them in there because I don't take them out. <laughs> no, really, there's not that many. Um, Quiver was okay. It's a bit florally for me. Zen Garden, I have not tried Zen Garden. I have tried Sensi Clean. Sensi Clean is good. Um, but I just find that that's too normal. It's too predictable. <laughs> I like to be a little bit unpredictable. Um, so Honeymoon Hideaway is awesome in the laundry stuff. So that is product number one that I love. Um, and my favorite product. The other things that I absolutely love, and this is a new one for me because I, again, sometimes I just don't try things because I think that I know what it's going to be like and I'm always pleasantly surprised that I'm wrong. <laughs> um, still waiting my two favorite scents to be in the laundry stuff. Maybe one day. Um, so this is our Scentsy Fresh, okay? Scentsy Fresh is what I spray on the dog bed, on the couch, on the rugs, on the curtains, on the chairs, in the air. I spray it everywhere. Um, I've had black raspberry vanilla in the past. I didn't find that it was very strong. I love strong scent. Um, I have the Honeymoon Highway. Yeah. Oh, Tina. Hi. Um, yeah, the dryer discs are pretty awesome. You should try the, the washer whiffs, Tina. You'd like that too. Um, so Scentsy Fresh is kind of like Febreze. Do you know if they are going to add more scents in laundry? Um, every season they add one, maybe two, or replace them with others. So yeah, they're going to start mixing them around. I don't know how many they're going to add. And a lot of it is because it's hard to get certain ingredients to create a scent that would work for that product. Does that make sense? Huh? No pun intended. How long do the dryer ones last? The dryer ones last, they say 15 loads, but they're full of baloney. They last a lot longer than that. Um, and it has anti-static properties because it's that um, hard plastic that does not melt that bounces around inside of your dryer creating or breaking static um, so that's kind of why I have the other ones left in there uh, some of them might not even smell anymore but they've been in there for a really really long time and I do a lot of laundry a lot of laundry um, so Scentsy Fresh is amazing Love how many more hides, one of my favorite scents. I had no idea it came in laundry stuff. Well, now you do. See, this is why I do these videos. <laughs> Knowing my luck, they won't be able to find to add my two scents, but we'll see. Bailey, which ones are they? Which ones are you looking for? Um, okay, so Scentsy Fresh is just that. It freshens up everything. Um, fabric, sheets, spray it in the air like that, and it's amazing. <laughs> um, however, hi, Mark. Um, I have been with Scentsy for almost six years. I knew that this was available, never tried it because I thought, boy, that defeats the purpose of having scent to create something called odor out. I thought odor out did not have a scent. I was wrong. Hi, Andrew. Um, odor out is probably the most amazing scent that there is. It's a clean, it's very clean. It kind of has a bit of cottony smell to it, um, but it's just nice enough to mask litter boxes or <laughs> puddle pads or piddle pads, whatever you want to call them. Um, and no, I have not, Mark, because we're talking about my favorites. And actually, I should probably go get um, something in the bathroom that's one of my favorites from the men's, the groom's line. But thank you for sharing that, Mark. Um, Mark, if you would do me a favor and share why the cream shave soap is one of your favorites. Um, okay, so Odor Out actually is amazing. 
It comes in Scentsy Fresh as well as our room sprays. So Odor Out only comes in those two products and it is worth trying. I would get it in this and see how much you absolutely love it. So that's that. My third product that I love, and I talked about it today, if you are a Facebook friend of mine, you saw this, um, is our kitchen soap. Sunkissed Citrus is my favorite besides lemon, um, coconut lemongrass. Those two have that clean, fresh smell that I like in the kitchen. Um, don't need a lot. It does not produce a lot of suds, but boy, does it clean. Um, and I've done what they call the five minute test on like lasagna pans and things that have been really, really sticky, icky stuff. Um, you pour a couple drops or a couple pumps into the dish with hot water, let it set for five minutes, and then it just kind of wipes right clean. It's amazing. Does it mask or does it remove the bacteria that makes the odor? There used to be something called ozone that did that. Yeah, I don't, I think it masks. I don't think that it has the properties. It's just, it's kind of like Febreze, so I think it just kind of does that quick scent. Whoop. My computer's going crazy. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. <laughs> yeah, you need to try the kitchen soap, Erica, because, um, and this, if you make a solution and put it in a bucket and use it to wash your floors, wash your walls, this stuff's really, really, really good. No grimy after residue either. It's, it's, I love it. Um, great product. Kitchen soap, you get 16 ounces. I'm not telling prices because you know me, I don't have them and I don't know them. Um, I, I do, let me tell you. Uh, wash your whiffs in the tub are 30 bucks. This two pack of discs is seven bucks. This is all US pricing, by the way. Um, the laundry liquid is $16. It does a 50 medium loads. Um, Scentsy Fresh is $12 for 16 ounces. Kitchen soap is 10, no, $14 for 16 ounces. Um, you also should know that the kitchen soap is sulfate and phosphate free. They are all concentrated. Yes, Virginia. Smells amazing. Let me go back and read marks. I used so many shave creams. I've used so many shave creams. And the thing that I don't like about most is they dry out your skin and they don't last that long. Cream shave soap leaves my skin feeling so silky smooth and just a pea size amount goes a long way. That's awesome. And that's our groom um, shave soap. Let me go pull that up. Uh, cream shave soap. That is the product that I was gonna actually, is that my Katie and Jess? Oh, hi Katie and Jess. Happy belated birthday, Jess. Um, so the cream shave soap is the thing that I use in the shower. Ben uses it to shave and I also use it to shave. Um, number four is our favorite scent. What is your favorite scent, Mark? Did you already do that? Yeah, Becky, number four. Um, uh, all right, so the cream shave soap is $20. You get four fluid ounces and you don't need a lot. So that too goes, it can go a long way, okay? Um, all right, so then the other product that's on my list is this number four, is the counter clean. Number 68 is your favorite. Um, and we don't sell 68 anymore, isn't that sad? That's the one that they removed. Oh no, 68's right there. That's Orville's favorite. Mandarin, violet leaf, and vintage leather. Ooh. Number four is lime, crushed mint, and cedar wood. Those are the two that we just mentioned. That's why it doesn't lather or bubble up. Sulfate free. Right. Sulfates strip natural moisture from your skin. So sulfate free is an awesome thing for sensitive skin. Alicia, thank you for sharing that. I was not aware of what that even meant, to be honest with you, and I'm really glad that you shared that. Thank you. Yeah, so sulfate and phosphate free. 
Um, okay, so the counter clean, again, I've got it in the matching Sunkissed Citrus scent. Um, this is actually pretty cool because basically what happens, um, and I'll read it right off the bottle so I don't say it wrong. Oh, okay. Um, this all-purpose spray forms a clear barrier on all sealed surfaces that repels dirt and gets stronger with regular use. So I'm going to go and shut this door. Uh, it didn't help, but that's okay. Hopefully that's not bothering you guys in the background. Um, okay. So, no, we are not, Lene. This is for customers. We're not doing team stuff. Um, okay, so citrus. These are my favorite items. That's what we're going over. Um, not really going. I'm just sharing my favorite Scentsy items with you guys. So the counter clean kind of creates this barrier so that the next time it repels the stains and the stickiness and that sort of thing. That's what I like about this. And I've used it for my doors. I used it for the counters, for the cabinets. Um, I've used it for a lot of different things and I really like the way that it cleans. So 16 fluid ounces. Um, the counter clean is $10. Okay. All right. So those are all of the non- wax and non-warmer things. Now, I'm going to share with you my favorite scents for the fall. Um, and I'm missing, I think I'm missing one. Um, yep, I'm missing one because I don't have any here. So the one that I'm missing is blueberry cheesecake. That's kind of my all-time favorite. Um, I'm curious what your top three favorite scents for wax is. I can't pick. Mine depend on season. Mine kind of do too. Um, I use counter clean on my floors for pet accidents. Well, there, yeah, that'll work. Absolutely. Um, okay, so wax goes for $5 each, or you can do buy five and get one for free. So that would be $25 for six bars. So that's your best bargain. And you can pick whatever scents that you want. It doesn't have to be six of all the same scents. Um, okay, so one of my newer favorites is Casting Spells. Casting Spells is our scent of the month for last month, I think it was. Um, totally love Casting Spells. Or is it this month? Maybe it's this month. <laughs> I can't remember. But it's still available, so that much I know. Um, I think casting, I think it was September for Halloween. Oh, my website is in Spanish. Hmm, how'd that happen? So, let's see, why can't I find, there it is, it was. Yeah, September. Okay, so farm stand. You're right. I have that one in there too somewhere. So casting spells is our September warmer uh, scent of the month. And they last for six months. They'll stay in rotation for six months is what I should say. Um, so you can get the scent of the month for six months, including the month that it's released. Um, casting spells has... A bewitching blend of apple drizzle, roasted pear, and cinnamon bark. And I don't know why I like it because I'm not big on anything but the apple drizzle. But it smells amazing. Love it. So that's one of them. The other one that I like for winter, ugh, Silver Bells. And Silver Bells is one of our fall scents, our winter scents, um, and it is described as minty candy canes dance over warm and welcoming pear, all enveloped in a velvety blanket of caramel and vanilla sugar. Obviously, I must like pear. That smells amazing. Jess, this is your favorite? Love this one. So that's on my favorite list. 
Um, a new one that's on my favorite list. Oh my God, I love that one. Oh. I'd warm them all if I could at all times. Oops. Is a Christmas, uh, no, cranberry garland. Why am I not being able to spell this? <laughs> cranberry garland. Mixed with very cranberry and Eskimo kiss is great. Ooh. We need smell of vision. I know. I agree, Debbie. Um, okay, so cranberry garland is. Sweet tart cranberry grounded by sage and earthy pine cones. This smells so much like Christmas time, and I don't know why. I think it's like when you walk into the florists at Christmas time and they have all of those like kissing balls, the pine balls, and the wreaths, and then you add cranberry on top of that. Oh my God, it's so delicious. That, I don't know why I picked that one. I think I thought it was something else. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not telling you what it is either. Hi, Sochi. All right, so this one is called Farm Stand Pumpkin. And this is the one that is our scent of the month for this month. Love this one. This, If you guys like pumpkin, you're going to love Farm Stand Pumpkin. It's amazing. Even better warmed. Um, Farm Stand Pumpkin... is oops it doesn't like it when i put half words farm stand pumpkin is indulgent notes of fresh apple cinnamon stick pumpkin and caramel and we all know that i love caramel Ugh, love it okay next is apple butter frosting Mm, that one smells even better when it's warmed, by the way. And who was Orville was telling us the other day to smell the bottom because it smells different. Because the oils go down to the bottom of the bar. <laughs> it smells different. Okay. Um, apple butter frosting is delicious. You need that one. <laughs> Um, where is apple butter frosting? Right here. Okay. Apple butter frosting is let this heartwarming melody of baked cinnamon spiced apples and decadent vanilla buttercream be the icing that finishes your holiday decor. <sighs> Yum. It's delicious. All right. Change it up a little bit. Now, this one is an all-time favorite of mine. Love it, love it, love it. Um, anybody tell me which, well, that's my information, but anybody tell me which one it is? Anybody? Anybody want to guess which one it is? One of my all-time favorites. All-time. Anybody want to guess? It is... Frolic in a, <laughs> Maria got it, Maria got it, uh, frolic in a forest of evergreens as fir needles fall among aromatic white cedar and musk with a wintry whisper of citrus, OMG, <laughs> hi Emily, oh I love this one, maybe it's because my husband's a logger, this is what he smells like, oh that smells Amazing. Winter Pine, one of my faves. All right. To go along with the pine-ish, this one is also one of my favorites for the same reason. Hi, Candace. Look at all my cousins coming in. You guys rock. So this one is a little bit different. Breathe in fresh forest air Balsam, spruce, and cedar branches embrace the warmth of amber and woody pine cones. Very snowy spruce smells just like a Christmas tree. Like, 
just like a Christmas tree. Just like a Christmas tree. Love, love, love that one. I very much like the woodsy scents. Okay, next one, a little bit different. But I fall, I fell in love with this one just recently. And I do smell all of them when they just come out because I get the testers, but sometimes it doesn't really connect with me until maybe a certain time that I smell it, a certain place I smell it, I don't know. Notes of cocoa powder, coconut cream, and caramel. Of course, it's got caramel in it, so I must like it. But this one reminds me of chocolate cake, like moist chocolate cake. <laughs> what it smells like. Chocolate coconut cream. Chocolate coconut cream. Now, I will say, and I'm going to pop it out. I smell a little bit of coconut in there, so I'm not sure that's, I guess maybe that's why I'm getting it with the cake because oh, it's just, it's so deliciously yummy. So that's this one. Chocolate coconut cake. <laughs> cake. <laughs> Chocolate coconut cream. I've got cake on the head now. Okay, <laughs> moving on. Um, okay, this one's pretty simple. Haha, <laughs> no pun intended. Um, because it is just simply vanilla, and that's exactly what it smells like. If you ever opened up a bottle of vanilla extract, that's what it smells like. It reminds me of my mama's mamas pudding pie really that's awesome hi ashley um so simply vanilla is it's sweet but it's not as strong and and to be honest with you i use this one a lot to mix with other things so if there is something that has too much cinnamon for me i'll put in a cube of simply vanilla and it tones it down i love it it's a great mixer and then lastly this one reminds me of Central Park Praline, which we don't have anymore. Um, mm, this is just so yummy. Um, sugar and spice and everything nice. Deep caramel and swirls of butter with roasted pumpkin and glazed pecans. What? <laughs> this one's called Everything Nice and it smells amazing mm. so those were my favorite products from Scentsy and my favorite scents for right now because <laughs> I do it does change um, did you know that if you smell your own skin it'll neutralize your scent receptors when you're testing scents but you didn't know that okay so recap all of those scents counter clean Scentsy Fresh, Odor Out, Laundry Liquid, Kitchen Soap, Dryer Discs, and my favorite, 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 Washer Whiffs. So those are my favorite products. And I'm glad that you joined me to share that with you guys. That didn't make any sense at all. <laughs> um, if you have questions on any of the things that I just talked about, don't hesitate to message me, okay? And if you want any of it, of course, don't hesitate to message me. Or you can just go to my website, beautyincense.net. Um, do you use... I do use the clothing conditioner. Um, I'm out right now. <laughs> Hence the reason I didn't show it to you. Um, and the only issue that I have with the, the conditioner is that it doesn't have... Um, it does not have Honeymoon Hideaway. So I combine it with Scentsy Clean and I find sometimes it takes away my Honeymoon Hideaway. So I don't use it all the time. Um, but yeah, it's, it's, it's a good product, definitely. All right, have an amazing evening, you guys. Um, I also wanna do one shout out before we go. Uh, I wanna wish John Sparks a congratulations for making it to director last night. He promoted and I'm super proud of him and um, wish him a bunch of success in his upcoming journey with his um, Sensi business. So congratulations, John. All right, guys, we'll see you later. Bye.